Hey guys, it's Lewis, and the car we're going to be reviewing today, as you can tell, is really exciting. It's a 2009 Chevrolet Corvette base model. So I'm going to go over the engine, interior, some customs in this car, and then we're going to take it for a test drive. So we got the hood open up, you got your your nice written Corvette logo there, and it's an LS3 6.2 liter V8 engine, which I honestly believe it to be a great engine. And we got something here that says slack thing. I don't know what that means. We got fun right there. I'm going to get into the car. You got a carbon fiber custom steering wheel. This looks good. And you got more a Corvette towel. You got your screen right there. It's kind of old. It's from 2009. Here you got your stuff like your speed and RPM. You got a speedometer going about up to 220, and you got about 7,500 RPM on here. And as you notice, we got more carbon fiber on the logo. And we got your auto. We got the volume right here, and you got a cup holder. You can put coins in there, stuff like that. And as you might have noticed, more carbon fiber. This is made out of carbon fiber, a lot of this car. And then you got another Corvette. It says on your airbag. So you got more carbon fiber over here. And what? This car comes with 500 horsepower, which is good for a 2009 car. Or, or 2009 sports car, because that's really fast, 500 horsepower. And the weight of this car, it's a lightweight car. It's about 3,180 pounds or 3,180. So I'd like to, to go over the pricing of this car. When new, it cost just over 50000 and it has went down in value for a car looking like this. You can probably get it for 30000 or 35000 which is a cheap price for a car looking like this. So the history of this car, we all know that this, they had a lot of generations from the C1 to nowadays they have C8. This one's the C6. And it came out a few years before 2009. So then they, a few years after it, they came out with the C7. And they had that until 2020 when they came out with the C8. And all that. That's a quick history of the car. There really is a lot in this car. You could fit a couple sets of golf clubs probably makes it useful for traveling put suitcases in there and everything so a few more stuff in this car you got the GM badge right here and you got a louver same on the other side same stuff got some nice sporty Michelin tires pilot super sport so you got super sport tires which is making them super tires there you can see it says corvette right there and this car is a convertible it drives really good even on sand it's nothing like an off-road vehicle it still drives good so you got the leather interior in this car making it really comfortable so this car is really safe extremely safe and it is luxurious and you even got a corvette towel that it comes with 
got your screen as you could tell this car is kind of old you got your air vents right there you got button right there more carbon fiber surrounded so you got an LED light right there and more LED lights on the steering wheel because it's custom steering wheel so now we're gonna get the car started up that sounds good we got another LED right here so the height of this car I forgot to mention is 49 inch low car and 49 inch good Looks like a supercar and drives like a supercar. So it is a supercar. So now we're gonna take this car for a test drive, and as you could tell, it drives really good. And it is extremely safe. Got your auto temperature. It's 37 out right now. Let's change the radio. You would use this. All right, so that is such a great sound the car is making. That you could just hear it. That does sound good. Oh, that's oh, that's some sound. We were just driving 70 miles an hour. Well, I wasn't driving. That that was going 70 miles an hour. Like. Oh my. Okay, you got a lot of RPM. Now we hit a red light. So we slowed down. We were just going about one or two miles an hour right there. And some of you might have heard that still makes a good sound. That is really good. We got this right here to cover the sun if you So good. Here you can roll the window now. Get more of the sound. There. This is why the 6.2 liter LS3 V8 supercharged because as you can hear that sound everyone driving by is probably looking at this car and being like what it's like this is definitely the greatest car in the world There's a lot of wind, and we're creating wind. That is great acceleration. And 4.1 seconds, or whatever this does, it probably could do 3.54 seconds. Maybe. That is still fast for a car. In 2009. So this does drive good.
get that feeling that it's fast. It does make some nice sounds. Still does drive smooth and we just went through a tunnel so you can get more of the sound of the car. And go. We got a Volkswagen right there. They must be looking at us. So if you saw someone driving around in a supercar. Like, like even they. looking at us. So this car does create a lot of wind because it's one it's going fast and two it is fast. Go. There we got a lot of RPM going. So thank you guys for watching this video. Make sure you like and subscribe and hit the notification bell so you won't miss out on any new videos. Stay tuned for more new videos come out. Check the description for the score. And I'll see you in the next one.